Founded along the banks of the St. Lawrence River in 1642, Montreal has grown to become the largest city in the French-speaking province of Quebec and the second largest city in Canada. For 26 miles along the St. Lawrence River, from old Montreal to beyond Mount Royal, there are numerous neighborhoods, cultures, and attractions. Join me on my Montreal, Quebec, Canada adventure. Like most visits to Montreal, mine begins in old Montreal, where my guide, Nathalie, takes me to the Place de Yeauville, where the 1893 obelisk honors the first settlers and the original site of the mission Ville Marie. So this spot is where it all began, where Montreal began. It is actually Ville Marie, the name of the first settlement. It started here in 1642. You've got the St. Lawrence River right ahead of us. So it created a V-shaped piece of land, very okay. convenient, surrounded by fresh water. So they thought, hey, that's the perfect place. Let's call it home. The first purpose, and I quote here, was to convert the savages of the New World to Catholicism. Uh. So this was a religion-based settlement. And Natalie, we didn't have to go far from the monument to the first settlers to find a little bit of history. What you're looking at is the signature of the head chiefs of the Amerindian tribe that were in the area. So in 1701, the uh, governor of Montreal invites those tribes to come to Ville-Marie in order to sign a peace treaty that would allow an easier type of commerce between the settlers and, of course, the Amerindian. Well, so before Montreal could become the great commercial center with a port, it had to start somewhere. It's always good to start with a little peace. It usually is. You know, Natalie, ever since those early days of the first settlers, I know that Montreal has changed quite a bit. It has changed. The first major change was actually in 1763, because at that point, we became British. So we got ah. conquered by the British. So at that point, this predominantly French and Catholic settlement becomes English and Protestant. So what is Montreal today? Is it a French town? Is it a Canadian town? English town? What is it? I'd like to say all of that. Actually, Montreal is French, it's English, it's multicultural. Mm -hmm. But it has also that European joie de vivre. <laughs> Thank you, Natalie. I get to experience modern Montreal's happy hour, saint Set. I understand that's five to seven, but it really starts at four and... Finishes whenever. <laughs> Sante. Cheers to Sante.